hey guys welcome to my channel welcome to a week in my life and welcome to coming along with me as i do what i do this week today is a sunday and jack and i just went to church and now we're home i gotta figure out what we're having for lunch i'm very excited for what this week's gonna hold. I don't know what it's gonna look like, but we'll see. Jack is trolling me. I'm not trolling. This is what I look like after a long day at work. Look, say hey. She just wants my food. So this is obviously my first time kind of trying this again. And We'll see what happens. Obviously, I didn't get um, my morning on video. I'm eating my leftovers, and then I got to go. Got to go to Young Life. We're having a game night. Um, not something. Jack, my husband, works for Young Life, and I lead. I lead Young Life as well. So we're gonna go. I'm gonna finish this, and we're gonna go have a game night. Our apartment is truly a hot mess right now. We just moved like two weeks ago. Oh, it's lighting. Two weeks ago or something like that. Um, and we still like have furniture we're not keeping that I need to send back to my dad, all these things. And so anyways, that is why it looks like a hot mess. Parts of it are like, okay. Parts of it are a hot mess. Okay, had to make one pit stop. My excursion was a fail because I was really looking for a blazer, is really what I was looking for, to wear to Thanksgiving, and no blazers, not a single blazer. Um, I couldn't even video much in there because I was in such a rush, but anyways, now it's probably a good thing I didn't find one. I'm going to keep looking though. I feel like it's supposed to be tomorrow morning. <laughs> That's awesome. It was that type of nap where you think it's the next day. I guess I should up. I'm just leaving game night. It was fun. We played some games. It wasn't like board games. It was more so like um, group games, if that makes sense. And I probably shouldn't do this and drive, so I will. I'll be back when I get home. There's not much going on here at the Monday house on Nola. Living her best life still. I love that for her. We have Jack putting up his putting up his clean clothes. This is the most organized I've ever been in my entire life. That's facts. And what happens when you get married? When I get home from work, I don't ever change my outfit right away. You can ask my roommates even from college and ask Jack. Truly I will keep my work outfit on. The entire day even in the morning my best friend good morning it is like 6 15 it's tuesday morning now the next day and on tuesdays jack and i go to fca at the high school that we leave young life at um and so uh, can i get ready i'm so tired so i usually have two ways that i Two ways that I do my makeup. And this is the way that takes like five seconds. Can you see this? Merit, the minimalistic. I was influenced to buy this. <laughs> and I love it. There's really no rhyme or reason to this. I just do whatever, whatever I want. That's okay. Okay. We're back from FCA. And I am making breakfast. I really actually need to go to work. I need to leave in like five minutes, but. I'm off, I'm headed to work. Um, we got back from FCA and I didn't really have, I didn't really have much time at all. I literally made quick that quick breakfast and it was so good. And then I'm headed off. Um, I didn't get time to make a latte either. So, I'm just gonna have to make a cup of coffee at work, which is fine. 
Um, I really did want a lot to go because it's a rainy and cold day. And so it just would have been perfect. This is one of my favorite parts of my desk. <laughs> Having the heater. So I'm just leaving work and it's 520, just a little bit past five, you know. Um, and I don't love that it's dark, dark 30 when I get off work. Okay, hey Nana. Anyways, this was my outfit for today. Great, so you can clearly tell we did not make up the bed. Hello? You can definitely hear her eating in the back. Anyways, now I'm just tired. But thankfully, we have Thanksgiving. Um, well, yes, we have Thanksgiving, but we have a break from work um, tomorrow. Thanksgiving and Friday. So I'll go back to work till Monday, which is so nice. So anyways, um, we're going to figure out what it's going to look like, but I just have some time to hang out and really um, just enjoy life. And not that I don't enjoy life when I'm working, but it's always nice to have a little bit of a break, you know? It's the next day. There's Jack. It's the next day. Last night we, oh, what was last night? Today. Tuesday. Nothing. Oh, we watched Dancing with the Stars and ate popcorn and like that was it really. He likes to troll me. Whatever. Anyways, this morning we woke up. Thankfully, we both have today off. So. We both have today off. So, I'm making a latte and um, what else are we doing? Noel's being proved. Yeah, I don't know what Noel is doing over there. Um, we're running a turkey trip tomorrow for Thanksgiving with Jack and my mom and my brother. So that will be interesting. I'm going to go get ready to go pick up those rice packets. That is yummy. I didn't even show you. Here we go. Beautiful. I went and picked up our race packets for the 5k tomorrow, which the shirts are actually really cute. I feel like sometimes race shirts are either very hit or miss, so they're actually real cute. I'm excited. And then I went to Target, of course, and got um, paper towels and dog food, which is not exciting. I got some other fun stuff. When Nola, our dog, was a puppy, she should have this really expensive food that we started her on. Um, because the vet was like, it's the best, it's good, da da da. But then she got a little bit older and we were like, that's not sustainable for the budget. So anyways, now we get her this Target food, which also probably is still bougie, but it's cheaper and she loves it. So, that's great. And then, here are my other goodies. Got this beautiful, I didn't try it on because I was not feeling it. I got this beautiful dress. It's you obviously can't see it all here. I'll let you know when I wear it. It's this long maxi dress and it's like a dark brown color, but it's beautiful. And then I got some eggnog, which I feel like is very, yes, you love it or you know you hate it. And I'm not planning on drinking it by itself. In fact, I am just planning on using it for eggnog lattes, which is the season. Almost, at least. And then I got some butter and some rosemary to make one of those butter candles. Have you seen it? I saw it on um, Instagram in a reel. 
and I thought it was so weird because I thought people were literally dipping bread into a real candle and I was like yikes but in fact they're not you make a candle completely out of butter and spices and then you put it in bread like you cut out the middle and put it in and then you have like a little appetizer bread butter dip so stay tuned I'm gonna try to make that for Thanksgiving a little appetizer while we're all waiting to eat so and then I got some wrapping paper which is the real reason I went to Target but then I remembered we needed paper towels dog food and I wanted to make the butter candle so you know you can't go to Target and only get what you need anyways here let me show you all my wrapping paper I won't tell Jack actually tell him because he'll see this video and um, our bank account anyways this is, I really, you might say, did you need that much? I had no wrap in my ba wrapping paper. So, anyways, now I'm headed home and we have some more errands to run. It's not very often that Jack and I both have a day off together. Um, so, got some errands to run. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look how beautiful this is for lunch. Yum, yum, yum. I guess it's lunch, yeah. We're at Walmart. I tried to do a mobile order, plan ahead. I picked everything up on Sunday for Thanksgiving. And I was making deviled eggs, and they did not turn out well. So last, uh, we're here getting yum, more. Yum. And... It wouldn't be a Walmart run without. Dum da da da. Beast Balls. Sponsor me, Mr. Beast. No, just kidding. Well, I mean. Now I'm making some bread because it has to proof overnight. One time I was making those lemon poppy seed muffins and I it called for vanilla extract. So I'm making them, um, you know, put, put the vanilla extract in and um, I go to taste the batter when I'm pouring them into the muffin tin, the muffin pan, the muffin man, <laughs> the muffin pan. And I was like, what is that taste? It was so strong. And so I was like, maybe I just like put way too much vanilla, but I've, I know what vanilla tastes like, and so I was like, maybe I just have way too much vanilla. Well, come to find out, I had used anise, I don't even know if that's how you say it, that's how I say it, anise extract. I don't know what that is, it's like a, let me show you. I have it up on a shelf by its lonesome so I don't forget and use it again thinking it's vanilla extract. But they look the exact same. So, like the container that I said. Focus. This is what it looks like when you're mixing it. It looks very shaggy. And then I'm just gonna cover it up. There she is in all her glory. I'm just gonna leave it there and we'll see what she looks like in the morning. Okay, we're out here. Okay. You're gonna get my 12 minute mom or probably. Probably. <laughs> Alright, we're out here. Um this is what I was telling you guys about. I don't know what came over us, but we're here, we're running. We're happy to be here. We're here, we took a woohoo! A brief um a very short walk. <laughs> this is only our second one. Yeah, we're doing great. We ran the whole first mile and about to start running again. We're coming up on Guys, we're coming up on mile two. This is incredible. Love you, turkeys. We're back. Okay, it is time to check on our bread before we put it in. Can you see? It proved a lot and I'm very excited.
She's a beauty. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I promised we got home from the race I've been baking all morning, and so, you guessed it. Made myself a latte. Like a very light. I think I under, underestimated how big this cup actually was. Vanilla, nutmeg, and brown sugar. I'm using my Arbonne CC cream. And this is where I'm like, I know this has to be how all the makeup professionals do it. Just like this. Don't you think? And then this, I love. It's um called Soft Focus Veil. It's also from Arbonne, but it's a tinted sunscreen. And it's wonderful. And I love it. So, that's all. All I have to say about that. Um, does this look good? Can you see? If you have never seen or used, what I'm about to show you is my favorite hair item that I own. It is Remington. I think three of my friends have bought it after they used mine because it is perfection. It's perfection in every way. I love it. Thank you. We're on the road going to Jack's parents and here's some of the butter candle and the apple pie that I'm going to bake at their house and then the sweet potato casseroles down there. Um, oh, it's bright. And we were probably 10 minutes away from the house, from our house and realized we forgot the deviled eggs. So now we're going back to get them. I'm over here with Jack and Grandpa Ike and, and Nola. And we are still waiting on some food to finish. Here's the remains of the butter candle. Oh my gosh, it's so good. We have just been eating so much of it. No some other appetizers. This is so cozy. Here we are, just waiting for the food. Here is our table set up. Hi guys, we're out here trying to do some Black Friday shopping. And we're at the Tanker Outlets right now, you know them. You probably love them as much as Ellie and I do. And let's just say the parking is Ridiculous. We went to Target. We went to Ulta. We went to Chick fil A. <laughs> Chick fil A. We started the day with chicken minis. Yes. And then went to Target and Ulta. And now we're here at the Tanger Outlets trying to get some good deals. That's all we're trying to do. Mm. But this, I wish you could see just how ridiculous this is. And all the cars back there. And really? That's only like probably a third of it. So we're just praying we get a spot so we can get those good deals, you know. It was a good time. Everybody was out putting squishmallows on the Christmas list. The um, everybody was out and about. So, anyways, we were out for a while. It took us like 35 minutes to park. 35. <laughs> <laughs> but then we got a few things, got some things for other people. That was really our goal. We got some stuff for ourselves as well. That was one of our other goals, just yeah. buying things for ourselves. Yeah. And now we're here with Charlie and Grace and the rest of the families in there making Christmas lists and watching football. Jack's making his Christmas list? Jack, are you gonna email to Sam this year? Yeah. Oh, yeah. good thing. So, anyways, oh, oh and we're making cookies. <laughs> we're getting ready to go watch oh the next goodness. Hunger Games, too. So, yeah. Scared. Ellie's real excited. He's tired. 
We're here for Small Business Saturday. I'm finding a lot of stuff for myself, but I can't buy it. Rough life. And then I tried on some real cute pieces, I'll show you. But they didn't. They didn't work. We're here with Grams, too. <laughs> This is the highlight of her day. I'm so happy. <laughs> we made it back home. Um, and when we got home, we just kind of unpacked and cleaned up a little bit. Try to get our lives together. You know, once you're gone, when you're gone for a few days and you come back, you just really need to reset. That's why I have my face mask. I'm about to take this off and go to bed because we're actually so tired. But anyways, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching this video. It's the start of the next week, so I really should probably just wrap it up here. I think this video is long enough as it is right now. So anyways, thanks for watching. If you liked this video, you can like and subscribe for more videos. I'm very excited to take you guys along with me. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you have a great week this week. Bye.